Aaron Judge, where's he going? Jack, you're on the clock. <laughs> no, anyway, great to have you with us here on Hot Stove. Bob Lorenz, John Flaherty, Jack Curry with you. That is the question, and as we sat here a week ago before Thanksgiving, and hope you had a great one, the conversation was about the Yankees making an updated offer to Aaron Judge. Chronologically, again, in the meantime past that, he met with the Giants. So what's going on with Aaron Judge? This is what free agency is all about. We always talk about players waiting for the opportunity to get to free agency. Aaron Judge was drafted by the Yankees in 2013 so it takes almost a decade as a player for you to get to this point and he should enjoy this point he should talk to as many teams as he feels that he wants to talk to he should make sure that he finds the best possible situation for himself because that's what he has earned all that being said I know the Yankees are confident and comfortable in their position we've heard what Hal Steinbrenner and Brian Cashman have said about how important judges to the Yankees they've expressed that to him in April they talked about a seven-year 213 and a half million dollar deal he turned that down so if we're just doing our due diligence and looking forward you have to believe that the deal is now probably an eight-year deal and you have to believe that the deal probably is in the 300 million dollar range because he had talked about wanting trout money and trout makes about 35 and a half million dollars a year so that's where I think we stand I think the Yankees are hopeful that judge will be their right fielder in 2023 but he's allowed to talk to as many teams as he wants to and the Yankees are going to continue to try and let him know the way they feel about him. Well, I'm glad that you said the Yankees are confident and comfortable with their offer. And if you're Aaron Judge, you think about it. All right, the Yankees made me an offer. Now I go out to San Francisco. I spend some time with them. They give me their pitch. They have Steph Curry and these other people trying to implore Aaron Judge to come on to San Francisco. But if you're Aaron, Jack, to your, your point, you have earned this right to sit back and be courted by as many teams as many organizations that want to get into this we know the Giants are involved if Jack is saying maybe that the Yankees have an eight-year offer on the table do the Giants stretch that to nine for somebody who's going to be 31 years old that sounds like a lot to me but if you're Aaron Judge you kind of sit back this week probably before the winter meetings get as many teams involved as possible I haven't heard of any other team except the Giants the Yankees and the Dodgers right the Dodgers of course we talked about that on our last show they loom on the West Coast as a team that has taken a lot of money off of its payroll and a team that would love to be able to have another star like judge so the winter meetings are coming a lot of players sometimes would like to get their situation resolved I think that judge and the Yankees will have future conversations I think the conversations they've already have have been positive and I actually thinks it makes a lot of sense for the two of them to have this marriage that is kind of on hold right now to be reunited again I think it makes sense for judge to be a Yankee I think it makes a lot of sense for the Yankees to make sure that judge is a Yankee and in listening to Hal Steinbrenner I don't think the Yankees are going to let another team swoop in and take away the player who is their marquee player. 